بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته It gives me great pleasure to welcome you to a very interesting episode of As-Safaratul Kiram Tajweed, the art of reciting the Quran Today, as we promised you in an earlier episode we have a very, very special and honored guest with us His name is Sheikh Nadi Rabi' Kishk and he is one of the famous Qurra of our times In fact, recently he was sent from uh, Egypt to the international competition of the Qurra, of the reciters of the Quran in Mecca, which is the most prestigious and the most honorable and the largest competition of its nature in the entire Islamic world. Almost 80 countries sent representatives to this competition. There were over 300 participants and that particular year, Sheikh Nadi, alhamdulillah, achieved the highest position. He was voted the best Qari by an international team of judges, the Qari and the, the person with the most melodious voice. So it is indeed a great honor and a great pleasure to have the Sheikh with us today. What we're going to do is that we're going to ask the Sheikh to recite uh, in a very beautiful voice the Tajweed for around six or seven minutes. And then we're going to stop and we're going to go back and rewind and study the rulings of Tajweed in every single verse and then we'll ask him to recite those verses again. So I ask the respected Sheikh, the Fadl of the Sheikh, the Tajweed, to start reciting from Surah Yasin. A'udhu Billahi Minash Shaitanir Rajeem Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim Yaseen Walqur حكيم إنك لمن المرسلين إنك لمن المرسلين على صراط مستقيم تنزيل العزيز الرحيم لتنذر قوما ما لقد حق القول على أكثرهم فهم لا يؤمنون إنا جعلنا في Oh, boy. 
وَأَغْشَيْنَاهُمْ فَهُمْ لَا يُبْصِرُونَ وَسَوَاءٌ عَلَيْهِمْ أَأَنذَرْتَهُمْ أَمْ لَمْ Jazakallah khair, mashaAllah, that was a very beautiful recitation as I'm sure all of you uh, heard. And now what we want to do is we want to go back to the beginning of the surah, surah Yasin, and we'll try to analyze the rules of tajweed and then ask him to recite it verse by verse. So we'll analyze each rule, see what rules there are, and then we'll see him implement those very rules. Uh, obviously, we start off with the Ya scene itself. Remember, we covered this rule in the Med. How long will the Ya be uh, put long? The harakas? Two harakas, okay. And the scene, how long will that be? Six. Six. Two, four, or six. Four. No, this is a mistake. No, the scene has to be six. The scene has to be six. And then we have Wal Quran al Hakim. What type of, if, if the Shaykh stops here, what type of Med will that be? Al Adil Sukun. So he will have an option of doing it. Two, two, four, four, or five. five. So let's see what the Sheikh does. So we see he did a mad of five on Al Hakim. Move on. In Naka, what type of ruling is going to be on the Noon Mushaddad? Al Ghunna, obviously. Okay, Lamina Al Mursalin. Here we have a Ra. Which is silent raw, preceded by a thumb, so it will be heavy. Now, because he chose five here, how much must he do over here as well? Five as well. Okay, you see he did it five? Yes. Uh, over here, ala sirat. What type of mud is ala over here? Natural, natural mud, mud tabi'i. Siratin. Okay, the alif will be light or, or, or heavy in the heavy. sirat? Heavy. Heavy. heavy because before it is a ra, which is heavy. And then mustaqim, once again, we'll have to do it five. Tafadl. Ala siratin mustaqim. Okay, now we move on to tanzil. What type of ruling will upon the noon second followed by za? Ikhfa. Okay, azizil rahim. The ra here once again will be? Heavy. Heavy. heavy, and then the uh, the lamb over here will be solar, solar, so it'll be dropped. Okay, for the Rasha. Tanzil al Aziz al Rahim. Okay, moving on. Ali Tunzira, one second, we'll have an ikhfa over here. Yes. Ra with a fatha will be what type? Heavy. Heavy ra. Okay, Qawman, we have a tanween followed by a meme. Then we follow by a meme. Idgham with ghunna. Okay, ma unzira. What type of mud is this? Separated. A separated mud munfasil. So he has an option once again of two, four, two, four five. Let's see what the shaykh will do. Unzira aba'uhum. What type of mud is over here? Connected. Oh, connected mud with mutasil. So he has to make it long. A meme second followed by a fa. Is of is the meme will be clear for whom Ghafirun once again meme second followed by a. Oh, yes. Uh, so it will be Ilhar and then the Ghafirun must be how long again? 
Five. Five, because five. He, he already five. did it before five. five. Okay, we move on to Laqad. We have a silent dal. A dal is a letter of Qalqala. Exactly. We have another type of mud here. Separate. How did he do the separated mud over here? Five. He did five. it five. So once again, he'll have to do it five over here. Aktharihim, silent meme, will be? Clarity. 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 Clear because you have a fahum. Once again, will be? Ilhar, la yu minun. Once again, I'll do it five. Faddal. Laqad haqqal qawlu ala aktharihim fahum la yu Okay, we forgot the ra in aktharihim will be light. 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 Okay. Inna ja'alna, inna noon, uh, we've done it many times. <laughs> we'll uh, have a ghunna on it. Now ja'al, now we have to be very careful. The lam must be clearly pronounced because yes. lam and noon have similar maqadij, right? So many times it's eaten up. Fi a'naqim, once again we have the mad which is separated. So we know he's going to do it five. A'naqihim is mad tabi'i, natural mad. Uh, meme second followed by a hamza. Will be Ilhar Shafoi Aglalam. Okay, what is going to happen here? Ikhfa, because it's followed by a fa. Okay, fa here ilal adhqani. Okay, the alif here is going to be light or heavy? Heavy. 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 Because it's preceded by a qaf. Fahum. Aha, silent meme followed by another meme. Idgham Shafoi. Idgham Shafoi. Fahum. So he'll have to do also what type of he'll have to do ghunna. And then a silent qaf will be qalqala. Okay, follow this. Inna ja'alna fi a'naqihim aghlalan fahiya ila al-adhqani fahum muqmahun Okay, we, we saw him apply all of those rules here. Uh, okay, wa ja'alna min bayni. We have a noon second followed by aba. What happens? We change it into a meme iqlab. Aydihim will be once again clear. Said then. We have a tanween followed by a wow. Idgham with ghunna. Okay, we have a silent meme in min khalfihim. Idhar. Okay, khalfihim once again. It will be idhar on the meme. Saddan will be once again. Ikhfa. Ikhfa. hum. Once again will be over here. Idhar shafui. Fa hum once again. Idhar la yubusiru. Faddal ya shaykh. وَجَعَلْنَا مِنْ بَيْنِ أَيْدِيهِمْ سَدًّا وَمِنْ خَلْفِهِمْ سَدًّا فَأَغْشَيْنَاهُمْ فَهُمْ لَا يُبْصِرُونَ Okay, we forgot the qalqala to point out the يُبْصِرُونَ and qalqala. Okay. وَسَوَاءٌ عَلَيْهِمْ What type of mud is here? Connected. Connected. So he has to make it long, okay? عَلَيْهِمْ أَأَنْذَرُ Now, careful, this is very difficult to pronounce. Two hamzas so close to one another. Notice how he will do it with crisp, clear two hamzas. Anzarta. What will happen over here? Ikhfa. <laughs> because it's followed by adha. Okay, here's a silent ra preceded heavy by a fatha. Ra. It's heavy. 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 It will heavy. be anzar. It will be heavy. Am lam. Well, both of these memes will be pronounced clearly. Idhar. Tunzir. What will happen here? Ikhfa. <laughs> because it's followed by adhal. Here is a silent ra preceded by a kasra. So light. So notice now how the sheikh will change between dhar with a heavy ra. And dhir with a light yeah, ra. Pay attention to his raz. Uh, the la yu'minun. Once again, he'll have a mud over here, which is out of the sukun, which is five for him. Fadl ish. Wa sawa'un alayhim a'anzartahum am lam tu'anzirhum la yu'minun. Okay, so this uh, clearly, notice how he said the a'andarta, the very crisp two hamzas over here. Well, unfortunately, we are at the conclusion of today's episode. But the good news is, inshallah, next episode will also have the sheikh with us. And he'll continue in this recitation. I know you're going to tune in for next time. Until then, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.